Hello everyone, my name is Ian. Welcome back to my hobby YouTube channel in brief book reviews. So today I'd like to talk to you about a phenomenal book I read there last year called Making Hay. It's about the story and times and boxing career of the legendary former cruiserweight and heavyweight champion of the world, David Hay. It's written by his good friend um, and a phenomenal writer called Elliot Warzel. Making Hay was released in, I think it was June or July 2012 under Curious, Curious and it is about 400 pages long, just short of 400 pages long. Um, it's a solid read, uh, easy easy to read, um, plenty of photos in there also in between certain chapters so it kind of, you have a, an understanding gives you more of an understanding and uh, broadens the imagination to what the writer's talking about uh, with David's career. Without spoiling the book for too many people, because uh, I really would recommend that people go out and buy this book. Um, because when you're reading about a lot of uh, boxing uh, and sporting books, it, it's kind of based on the um, just the, the, the career. It starts off obviously as w with the, the person when they're younger, growing up, and then the, the career, the development. But it kind of comes at it from a different angle with um, the writer who who had befriended David um his his time growing up david's time growing up and how they they kind of clicked together uh got involved with each other and elliot uh, magnificently um followed david um in his career and they became friends so um you know it, it really is a kind of a boxing book from a different kind of angle okay so my favorite part in this would probably be when they uh just starting off david's infancy um as a fire they're going out in the town and stuff like and they're going to certain places uh as young lads enjoying themselves and that and probably i wouldn't say the saddest moment in it but one of the mo most awkward times uh, i would imagine for david in his career reading about it would probably be his time when uh Adam uh, Adam Booth, who was David's manager, uh, brought him over to Cyprus and they were training and Adam was kind of, I think, wanting them to try and train like um, the former um, middleweight champion of the world, Sugar Ray Robinson. And of course, David being a heavyweight, he found it very difficult and there was a bit of a... Um, a bit of uh, animosity between the trainer and David. Um, which wouldn't have been nice in preparation for one of these build, biggest build-ups to one of his biggest fights of his career. Um, all in all, without saying anything too much about this book, the book is a phenomenal read. A phenomenal read. It will um, explain a lot of questions you might have as a boxing um, fan, a supporter, or someone who um, was like myself, um a follow of david's career from his very very young age you know i remember seeing david's um uh, i think it was in the Euro eurosport or some sort of eurosport in 2000 and two, 2001 as early as 2000 or 2001 so um to see him reach the pinnacle of his uh career and and win the heavyweight champion against nikolai valuev valuev was was fantastic in my opinion, David is the greatest uh, cruiserweight of all time, uh, without a shadow of a doubt. Uh, and that's like to like with uh, Evander Holyfield being right up there also. Um, you know that's that's no easy feat, and um, I really do believe he was he was a phenomenal fighter. He came at a great time in uh, in boxing also. All in all. Elliot Warzel as a as a as a as a reader, sorry, as a writer, he he is second to no one. He really is. He's he's second to no one. He is as good as a writer as what David was, a professional boxer, and I sincerely mean that. Um it was just excellently written, it really was very informative. Okay, this is called In Brief Book Reviews, and I'd like to keep it in brief. So um that's my brief uh, book review for today. I could go on about this book all day, I really could. It's an absolutely fantastic read. I would highly recommend it. Um, I'm, this is the second of four boxing books that I'm going to be covering uh, a review of that I've read in the last couple of years. So I, um, yeah, so that's my um, second review for this week in terms of the boxing, boxing books. Highly recommend it. Uh, phenomenal read. 
and uh, that's it that's my review for for today i um i hope you're all keeping safe keeping well and um thank you very much for watching and uh, take care all the best